Hello friends, this is Roland Idubo. Really nice to be with you today. Today I'm going to talk about dreams. Dreams. What is a dream? A dream is your personal ambition, tailor-made aspiration, and your vision for life. So I encourage you today, keep dreaming. You are never too old to dream. Abraham, the friend of God, picked up a dream at the age of 75. A dream is designed to make life better, to make the sons of men fair better. So God, in his infinite mercy, has entrusted every one of us with a dream. What is your dream? I am Roland Dupo. My dream is to make life better for everyone in the area of divine health. God has given me a healing ministry. In addition to that, God has also given me what they call gift mix, which means in addition to my healing gift, I'm a writer, I'm a poet, I'm a singer, a motivational speaker, and a teacher of the world. All this I'm bringing to bear on my vision for life. God has entrusted you with a dream. Are you dreaming? How do I dream? How do you dream? You dream by opening up your heart to God so that he can explore possibilities through you. Your heart, your mind is a treasure chest and God has put into every man the ability to dream. When you dream, you escape the natural world and all its impediments, its hindrances and its troubles. You enter into a realm of all possibilities. It is free of charge. You can dream any, any way or anything you want. But most importantly, it is always beneficial to dream the dream God has given to you. You shouldn't dream another man's dream. In Jeremiah 1.5, the Bible says, Jeremiah, before you were, your mother conceived you, I knew you before you were even born. I knew you by name and I ordained you to be a prophet, not to be an engineer, not to be a carpenter, but to be a prophet. So it's always better for us to, you know, align with God, God's dream. So I encourage you once again, keep dreaming. What does a dream really entail? What's the essence of a dream? It is God telling us that he's rooting for us. He's vouching for us, telling us that we can do it. Anything you are able to dream, you are able to accomplish if you are ready to pursue that dream. Abraham pursued a dream at 75. For a better world, during Abraham's time, the whole world was, you know, lost in idolatry. And with idolatry comes its trappings, superstition, you know, even rituals as bad as human sacrifices. God envisioned the world where men can live and be their brother's keeper. So he said, through you, I'm going to you know, raise a, a nation of priests. Abraham was true to his dream. Today, I encourage you, be true to your dream. It is your obligation to bring to pass and cause to materialize every dream you have in your heart. Joseph was called a dreamer, and eventually he became what God has envisaged. He became the ruler of the whole world, the ruler of Egypt. So right now, I will encourage you that it is your obligation to bring to pass what God has put in your heart. So keep dreaming. Uh, when you accomplish one dream, dream another. Presently, we are, you know, uh, in the middle of uh, advertising and promoting a musical effort. Mujubare is, you know, everywhere right now. So this it was just a dream. And now I'm living out that dream. So I encourage you to live out your dream. Your dream, you know, uh, shows forth your potential. You may not be up to par right now, or you may not see yourself as being able to accomplish that vision in your heart. But God is showing you and showing the world that you have that potential. That's why he gives you that dream. So live out your dreams. Live out your dreams. In our next video, I'm going to talk about our attitude to dreams. How do we pursue our dreams? What is the right attitude to pursuing our dreams? I just want to believe that you've been blessed with this message. Keep dreaming.
keep dreaming. Dreaming is a down payment on you, on your life, that God counts on you. And your being able to accomplish that dream with the help of God is your redemption of that particular shorty by God. Keep dreaming. The world needs you. Your dream is peculiar. Till made for you. I'll see you at the top. God bless you.